Somebody may shout, somebody may run, somebody may purge, somebody may just stand still and lift their hands. And too often we get the purpose of the Holy Ghost twisted. Jesus said, but you shall receive power. After that the Holy Ghost has come upon you and you shall be my witnesses. Power means the ability to achieve purpose. It means the ability to get the job done. And so he didn't give us the Holy Ghost just to shout. Can I help somebody in here today? If we don't have the Holy Ghost just so we could dance and speak in tongues, but to achieve his purpose in the world. And let me clarify this for you because speaking in tongues is not the only telltale sign of the Spirit. I know I just messed up because I'm standing in a Kojic church and telling y'all that. Uh, you, you see, my sisters and, and, and my brothers, we have a lot of folk speaking in unknown tongues, but their work is also unknown. The soul's that they bring into the kingdom are unknown. The lives that they touch are unknown. The work that they do are unknown. And what's the use of speaking in unknown tongues if everything else you're supposed to be doing in the kingdom is also unknown? You see, the Bible says that the fruit of the Spirit is love, joy, peace, long-suffering, gentleness, goodness, faith. And too many are speaking in tongues, but they're not bearing any fruit. 